സിംഗപ്പൂർ ചോയ്സ് സമർപ്പിക്കുന്നത് ഹൗസ് ബ്രാൻഡ് തനതായ സ്വാതിന്റെ സംതൃപ്തി പവൈഡ് ബോയ് ഓൾ ഇന്ത്യ സൂപ്പർ മാർട്ട് സിംഗപ്പൂർ ഹോൾസെയിൽ പ്രൈസ് ആയിട്ട് റീറ്റെയിൽ മാർട്ട് കോ സ്പോൺസേഡ് ബൈ തിരുമലാഗി ദ ട്രസ്റ്റഡ് ടെസ്റ്റ് ഓഫ് കൗകി വീണ്ടും ഒരു സൺഡേ ആയിരിക്കാണ് സിംഗപ്പൂർ ചോയ്സിൻ്റെ ഒരു പുതിയ എപ്പിസോഡ് സ്റ്റാർട്ട് ചെയ്യാനുള്ള ടൈമായി ഇന്നും നമുക്ക് കുറേ അധികം സെഗ്മെൻസും സെഗ്മെൻസിൽ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് ഏറ്റവും ഇഷ്ടമുള്ള കുറച്ച് കാര്യങ്ങളും കാത്തിരിപ്പുണ്ട് അപ്പോൾ നമുക്ക് നമ്മുടെ ആദ്യത്തെ സെഗ്മെൻറ്റ് കാണാം സിംഗപ്പൂർ മലയാളി അസോസിയേഷൻ അതിൻ്റെ നൂറാം വർഷത്തിലേക്ക് പ്രവേശിക്കുന്നു ഇന്ത്യയ്ക്ക് പുറത്ത് ആദ്യമായാണ് ഒരു മലയാളി സംഘടന നൂറ് വർഷം പൂർത്തിയാക്കുന്നത് തന്നെയുമല്ല സിംഗപ്പൂരിലെ ആദ്യത്തെ ഇന്ത്യൻ കൂട്ടായ്മയാണ് സിംഗപ്പൂർ മലയാളി അസോസിയേഷൻ ആയിരത്തി തൊള്ളായിരത്തി പതിനേഴിൽ ആരംഭിച്ച ഈ സംഘടനയുടെ നൂറാം വാർഷിക ആഘോഷങ്ങൾ ഒരു വർഷം നീണ്ടു നിൽക്കുന്ന പരിപാടികളാണ് സിംഗപ്പൂർ മലയാളി അസോസിയേഷൻ സംഘടിപ്പിക്കാൻ ഉദ്ദേശിക്കുന്നത് നമ്മുടെ ഭാഷ പഠിഞ്ഞിട്ട് ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് പഠിക്കണം ഈ സിംഗപ്പൂരിൽ എൺപതോളം പെർസെൻറ്റ് ശതമാനം മലയാളി ചീനന്മാരുള്ള രാജ്യത്ത് നമ്മൾ ചൈനീസ് പഠിക്കും എന്നാൽ നമ്മൾ ലിഫ്റ്റ് കയറുമ്പോൾ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ ഇത് പറയുമ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ തന്നെ നിൽക്കുമ്പോൾ പത്ത് വേറെ ജാതിക്കാർ അവർ ചൈനീസിലാണ് സംസാരിക്കുന്നത് നമുക്ക് തോന്നും ഇത് എന്നെ പറ്റിയിട്ടാണോ പറയണത് എൻ്റെ നടത്തിനെ പറ്റിയിട്ടാണോ പറയണത് എന്താണെന്നുള്ള നമുക്ക് അവരുടെ ഭാഷ അറിയുന്നത് അവർ തന്നെ നമ്മളെ സ്വീകരിക്കാൻ വളരെ തയ്യാറാണ് നമുക്ക് ഭാഷ പഠിക്കാൻ ഒരിക്കലും ബുദ്ധിമുട്ടുള്ള ഒരു കാര്യമാണ് ഇന്ത്യ ഇൻഡിപെൻഡൻ്റ് ആയി കഴിഞ്ഞ ഒരു ഭാഷ അവർ വളരെ അധികം പ്രൊമോട്ട് ചെയ്തത് റഷ്യനായിരുന്നു ആ റഷ്യൻ അധികവും സംസാരിക്കാൻ അറിയുന്നവർ കേരളത്തിലായിരുന്നു The Malayali community, I think, is very special in many ways. And, you know, if you just look at even the past SMA presidents, right? Uh, Kerala, in many ways, the way Kerala functions is similar to the way um, Singapore functions in that, you know, all the different religious groups all live in harmony. So we've got leaders from all the different communities here, whether it's Muslim, Christian, Hindu, all the different communities all come together, all get along, all unified, I think. Uh, I would say by language, but the reality is that in Singapore, most of the younger generation of Malayalis don't speak the language as well, which is a bit unfortunate, but maybe that can be corrected. Um, but I think one of the characteristics of the Malayali community has been its adaptability. So uh, I think people have mentioned uh, parliamentarians, um, quite a number of us in parliament, but we were just joking in the last term, we had Mr. Hari Kumar, he studied Chinese as a second language. Uh, I think Daniel speaks very good Malay, and I speak Tamil. Right. Um, I can understand Malayalam, I can't read or write, but I think all of us are in that group because you know, we were all born here in a generation where we couldn't really, um, have, we didn't have the chance to read and write Malayalam. But maybe that can be corrected in the next generation, so we will see with the efforts that come in. One of the things that I have to say is that I have to say 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 that അവർക്ക് മലയാളം പഠിക്കാൻ സാധിച്ചാൽ മലയാളം പഠിക്കാൻ പറയണം മറ്റു ഭാഷയെല്ലാം പഠിക്കാം ചൈനീസ് പഠിക്കാം മലയാളം പഠിക്കാം പക്ഷേ 
Singapore <laughs> But the other matra is that the program is not a program. We are 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 not a Namaskaram. I want to congratulate the Singapore Malayali Association on a very historic milestone on completion of 100 years. Um, the Indian community, broadly speaking, has been a really important and a part of the rich and multicultural society of Singapore and has made enormous contribution to its uh, success and its evolution, as I've said, as a multicultural society, which stands as an example to, to the rest of the world. The Malayali community here is one of the oldest components or constituents of the Indian community and it has been uh, today one of the most important parts of the Indian parts of the Indian community and has made a seminal contribution to the uh, country's development. They have done extremely well in terms of preserving their culture, their traditions, their art forms, uh, but have also gone on to achieve great success in every walk of life, uh, in public uh, life, in civil service, in professions such as law and medicine. Um, and uh, we wish, I certainly on behalf of the embassy, the community continuing success and continuing contribution uh, to uh, Singapore and to be the bridge it has always been between India, uh, between Singapore and Kerala and between Singapore and India. Uh, so Kerala has a country, as a state and Malayali community has always been uh, part of India's history of engagement with the rest of the world. They've adapted to the uh, world. They've made enormous contribution and they've left an important footprint in other parts of the world, including in Singapore. And today uh, we see that they are going to continue uh, to make that contribution going into that future. I'm really delighted uh, with today's uh, function, which was uh, uh, extremely well organized and I know they have a very rich calendar of event for the rest of the year. I look forward to participating in it and being part of this wonderful celebration for one year ahead. Thank you very much. House brand, Karinya Arvada Varshamai, Singapore in the Tana the Rujikutagalkum, Swadinum Oppamana. Nyangalude Voro Ulpanangaludeim, Vasanaim, Guname and Vim Natapadadirikan. Cryogenic Sangi the Vidyo Biogicha, Nyangaluda Tana Factory in Tayaraki Packaging. House brand. Tanad Swadin de Samtrupti. All India Supermart. Enjoy the sprawling one stop shopping experience in four floors. The premier All India Supermart offers wide range and great varieties of consumer products. Groceries to fresh vegetables, chocolates, lifestyle products, fashion wear, pharmacy and beauty. All India Supermart's futuristic self-service kiosk is a highlight for groceries. All India Supermart, 41 Norris Road, Singapore. Tirumalane, Sharkara Paisthana, strong support. Neidoshake, super support. 
ഗുലാബ് ജാമുന് ക്ലോസ് ഫ്രണ്ട് വീട്ടിലും ഇരുന്നലും ഏറ്റവും അടുത്ത സുഹൃത്ത് തിരുമലന്നേ തിരുമല Our price list possession Ayurveda at Ananta Ayurveda relax and detoxify unwind and rejuvenate your mind and body from an array of treatments and massage therapies get expert advice for specific ailments spinal and muscular conditions Ananta Ayurvedic Healthcare Buffalo Road and Yishun Street 71 Singapore call 63964494 Ananta Ayurveda reliving a treasured past hanifa the popular name in every household comes with a great deal of heritage and trust since 1962 hanifa's new self service supermarket with a diverse collection of products everything you need and something to suit everyone hanifa 118 Dunlop Street and 60 Serangoon Road, Singapore. Now, the trend is organic products. Organic herbs and medicines are very important to us. But this is a very important thing to us in the Ayurveda. ആയുർവേദം എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് പ്രകൃതിയോട് ചേർന്ന് നിൽക്കുന്ന ഒരു ചികിത്സാ രീതിയാണ് അതുകൊണ്ട് തന്നെ ഇതിന് ആഫ്റ്റർ ഇഫക്ട്സും സൈഡ് ഇഫക്ട്സും ഒന്നുമില്ല ഇന്ന് ഞാൻ നിൽക്കുന്നത് സിംഗപ്പൂരിലെ ഒരു ആയുർവേദിക് സെൻറ്ററിലാണ് അനന്ത ആയുർവേദിക് ഹെൽത്ത് കെയർ സെൻറ്റർ ഇതിൻ്റെ കൂടുതൽ വിശേഷങ്ങൾ നമുക്ക് ഇവിടുത്തെ ഡയറക്ടറായ മഞ്ചരി മാമിനോട് ചോദിച്ചറിയാം Hi ma'am welcome to Singapore Choice. Hi thank you. I read about Ananta Ayurveda Healthcare Center. Yeah. So I heard that none of you are from an Ayurvedic background <laughs> but you started this business and there's an interesting story behind this. Yes. So could you please explain it? I was born and brought up here. My parents as were born here as well. My dad's is name is Panir Chalwan and mom Saraswati and I have a brother Anand. I did my bachelor's okay. here in mm-hmm. Singapore and Uh, my MBA okay. at uh, James Cook University is an Australian based university okay. and they have a campus here okay. so i did my degrees over here okay so is it related to ayurveda no no it's totally not related <laughs> ananda ayurvedic was actually started it was established in 2005 okay. and it's been 11 years now yeah. and the story behind it is um, my mom Okay. She was actually suffering from varicose veins. Okay. It was really terrible. Okay. And we consulted western doctors here in Singapore, yeah. but um they said that you know all of them said she has to go for operation. Yeah. Yeah, and we were not very keen in this. Mm-hmm. Through a friend, we got to know about Ayurveda, okay. and we actually flew to Kerala, me, okay. my uh, my mom and my brother. Okay. And we were at Kottekal. Okay. For one and a half months right. for the treatment. We mm-hmm. stayed there and Yeah, we were there and she was all fine after that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, and then we came back. You know, we were discussing within mm-hmm. our family and my father suggested why not we do this in Singapore. Okay. And at that point of time in 2005, Ayurveda was not popular. Yeah. And I can even say that we were the pioneer to start Ayurveda, to okay. commercialize it in, in Singapore. Singapore. All right. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you actually went flew back to Kerala for yes, the treatment. Yes, we went right there. Okay, all right. After bringing it to Singapore, how do you see it? Like how are the people here responding to Ayurveda? How was it initially and how is it now? There was not much awareness. Mm-hmm. And as years went by, a lot of people are choosing Ayurveda or traditional medicines to western, I would say that. Okay. So do you have like customers like both Indians and people from here or how is it? Yes, we have mostly our customers are Indians. Okay. And uh we do have other races like okay. Chinese, Malay and Eurasians who oh, come okay. here. And we have uh, certain famous people who actually came to us. Okay. The national swimmer he came for treatment over here at okay. Ananda Ayurveda. Yeah. All right. In Singapore, uh what problems do most of the people come with? in singapore mostly it's for um maybe stress like headache uh, okay. and then back aches and um this is the common one diabetes okay yeah 
Okay, could you uh, like name few treatments that you give here? Sure, we do um, Sridhara, okay. we do Kili, mm -hmm. we do Kadivasti, right. and then uh, Abhyanga. Okay. Yeah, uh, our doctor latest, Mr. Suresh Babu, will be elaborating on this further. Okay, sure. So, uh, one thing I missed out is, how was your experience in Kerala? Uh, back then, I was very young. I was only 14 years old okay. at that point of time. I was seeing the treatment, what my mom was actually going okay. through. So, uh, what happened was, the doctors, they were actually doing some treatment. They pour some green oil on okay. her leg. Okay. And that was like basically every day. It was happening every single day. Okay. And my mom's leg used to be really dark, okay. like like her lower legs were really dark. And and like few after few treatments of pouring that oil, the color actually started changing. Okay. Yeah, it started changing, and her diet was also taken care of. They oil. have yeah, they actually do the food and all that. Vegetarian diet. Yeah, vegetarians okay. and. Some things, she can't eat certain oh. kind of food, like even vegetables. Okay. So all that was taken care of um, by them. Place. Yes. Okay. So how was your experience here, like with an Ayurvedic centre? For me, for myself, I feel that um, like if I need anything, uh -huh. I can just come here and <laughs> everything is taken care of so you trust for myself. Ayurveda so much? Yes, no. I do, I do. Yeah. Even if I, we did not do this business, I think compared to Western or Ayurveda, I will definitely go for herbal medicines. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so talking more about this place, uh, the therapists over here, do you bring them from India and do you like give them training here? Yes. Uh, for the recru recruitment wise, yeah. uh, we actually, uh, all of them, even doctors and therapists, they all are from Kerala. Okay. They are trained and uh, practice there. Okay. And then... Uh, they are here okay. and how we get to know them is mm -hmm. through referrals okay. let's say um, our previous therapies through previous therapies will actually recommend us or doctors recommend them okay. and then also through a portal there okay. is actually an online Ayurveda portals okay. where you can uh, find for recruitment Okay. Yeah, that's how it's actually done. Okay, so after they come here, do they have a training here? Yes, they do have a, like an in-house training, like mm -hmm. the rules and regulations okay. on uh, what they should follow or the customer service. Mm -hmm. You know, in India, the it's, culture is different. In exactly. Singapore, the culture is different. Yeah. So we, we will actually tell them on more of the culture in Singapore. Okay. I think like, hygiene is like very important here, like compared to India, obviously. Yeah, So uh, do you like take care of that? Like how exactly do you take care of that? Every patient, we actually uh, ch change the towels and then okay. we keep the environment clean. Mm -hmm. And, you know, after every massage, they actually wipe the, the bed. Okay. And, you know, different oils is being used for different people. Mm -hmm. So all that will be cleaned and it will be new again. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what about the medicines and oils? Do you get it from India? Yes, everything is from India, Kerala. Okay. We actually bring it down, we ship it down from there to here. What are your future plans like? <laughs> future plans is actually to definitely make it bigger. Okay. Maybe um, make an Ayurveda center or a, a training or to make, make it even like more beds, more bedrooms and... Okay. Do you already yeah. have other branches? Yes, we have a branch at Yishun. Okay. This is at uh, Little India and we have another one at Yishun. Okay, so two branches. Okay? Yes, two branches. All right. So thank you so much ma'am and all the best for your future. Thank you very much. Ayurveda, the science of life. It was originated 5,000 years ago. Lord Brahma, the creator of the universe. According to Ayurveda, everything in the universe composed of five elements, the air, ether, fire, earth and water. The air, ether is combined vada. Vada controls the movement of the body and it resembles the nerve function of the body. Then fire is pitta. Pitta regulates the digestion, hormone development, color of the skin, everything. Tempera also the temperature, controls the temperature of the body. The earth and water, kapha, kapha gives the Structure and stability of the body, lubrication of joints, everything. In each and every human being, the three energies present, but different proportions. Then, Shirovasti is a heavy treatment in Ayurveda. It nourishes the 
cranial nerves of the brain. Twelve pairs of cranial nerves originated from the brain. It controls the functions of sense organs as well as other functions also. Mainly we do the treatment is for hemiplegia, Parkinsonism, certain kinds of cardiovascular disease, headache, migraine, we do that. It will take 20 to 30 minutes, they put oil on the a cap fit on the head and keep warm oil in the head. Then another sirothara. Sirothara is dripping oil in the rhythmic manner of the forehead. It uh, improves the circulation of the brain, relieves the stress, insomnia and uh, other certain what was cardiovascular disease in the head. We do the same process, the buttermilk also. Buttermilk mixed with uh, some herbs, decoction, mix and then do the same process, the same manner. It is particularly for the psoriasis, sleeplessness, the calm of the body. Then another we do the pouch muscle, kiri. Kiri do, this uh, relaxes the muscle, then relieve the pain, improve the circulation, everything that. And another is the nasya, the treatment, the inhalation. They would put in three drops each nostrils for the sinusitis. Take out all the collections from the cavities. It is particularly for the sinusitis. That is the best treatment for the above the neck. Another is Kadivasti. Kadivasti cut particularly for the lumbar pain, lumbar stenosis, back pain. We do the barrier with the black gram paste and keep warm oil 30 minutes. It nourish the nerves, normally the sciatic nerve. It relieve the inflammation of the low spine. Netra Tarpana. This is a special treatment for the diabetic retinopathy. Those who have diabetic since many years, the nerves of the eye degenerated or damaged. We do the treatment with this specific medicated ghee. It will nourish and regeneration of the nerves. It is helpful for the diabetic neuropathy. Very good treatment is a Dharatnatra Tapana. In this episode, we have a lot of things that we have to do in the future. We will see you next time. That's it. Bye-bye. House brand Karinya Arvada Varshamai, Singapore in the Tana the Rujikutagalkum, Swadinum Opamana. Nyangalude Voro Ulpanangaludeim, Vasanaim, Guname and Mim Nastapadadirikan, Cryogenic Sangi the Vidio Biogicha, Nyangaludatana factory in Tayaraki Packaging. House brand Tana the Swadin de Samtrupti QBB Pure Ghee for cooking, baking, and barbecue. Superior taste in so many ways. QBB Pure Ghee. Get gorgeous with Vanessa's endless beauty techniques. Our caring beauticians will groom to love yourself. Facial for flawless and glowing skin, threading for shapely eyebrows, a perfect iconic hairstyle, waxing, just walk in for a head to toe captivating makeover. Vanessa Beauty Center, City Square Mall. 16 and 22 Buffalo Road. Call 6291-0977. Hi everybody, good morning. Ciao and Kalei Vanakkam. Selamat pagi. Namaskaram. How are you everybody? Hope you all are fine. I'm Chef Arifin from Singapore Choice. Today I've got something different with you. I'm doing it something special for you today with chicken chal frizzy masala with a muscle. So I'm going to use the house brand ready to cook chicken chal frizzy masala. So using this masala to cook the mussels will have a different flavor for you. Will be very nice and very easy to cook. If you have any visitors at home, you can cook it very fast. You will try it at home. Let's see the ingredients, except for the bell pepper and some onions. That's about it. And you got some mussels here. It's already pre-cooked once, and then the masala is ready. So you can just do it in minutes. You can enjoy yourself eating a different type of mussels with child crazy masala. So first of all, I'm going to add one tablespoon of oil. Add some onions. The bell peppers. I'm going to add all the mussels inside there. Eh? 
Um, I'm going to add in the chicken dal frizzy masala. I'm going to pour it in. Okay, let it cook for five minutes and it's dry and you're ready to serve. See how? So easy, so simple. You can do it at home. So you all you what you need is house brand jal frizzy masala at home. All you need is house brand jal frizzy masala. You can also use for chicken, you can also use for seafood. It's just a masala by itself. It doesn't mean that you only have to use the chicken. You can use anything, any seafood or any meat. Doesn't matter, it has to be chicken alone. So you should try this at home. Give me five minutes, once you're ready, I'll show you how good it is and I'll taste and tell you how good and how nice it is, okay? Okay, after five minutes, you see how good is it? Dry, like this, you have this very nice jal frizzy masala. We use mussels instead of chicken or any other meat you can also use but I use mussels today so I like mussels so I use mussels to do this jal frizzy masala. I'm going to plate it up now. A nice plate. It's all done. I'm going to add some chopped coriander on top of it and it's done. To address us. It's smoking hot. Look at it. Ooh. <laughs> okay. It's better than a chicken. Now you should try this with mussels. You know, it's the seafood or something else. Even the chicken wouldn't taste the best like these mussels. I like the mussels very much. So I don't know whether you like the mussels. If you think you don't like the mussels, you can use any other seafood or anything by using this house brand chicken jal frizzy masala. You should try this at home. I'm Chef Arifin from Singapore Choice. Bye bye. See you the next time. Huh? I'm gonna eat this. Don't watch me. I'm gonna sushi. <laughs> You'll love this. You're sure to love this. Singapore Choice in Nangala segment Ludek Pango Chakachaka Vishesham, okay, Larka Vishapatu Vishesikino, Adita Sunday, Vidam Korea, Digam Kashaka, my Varanare, bye bye. Singapore Choice, Summer Vichada House Brand, Tanada is sold in the Samtruti. Powered by All India Supermart Singapore, Wholesale Price at Retail Mart. Co sponsored by Tirumalagi, the trusted test of Kaugi.